Hey guys, so in this video, I'll be adding membership functionality to a Shopify store using the Bold Membership app. So if this is something you'd like to learn how to do, then watch this video. Okay, so here I have a fresh Shopify store. So if we show out the front end, it looks just like so. Okay, so first we're gonna install our membership app. So what we wanna do is go back into the admin and go into apps. Okay, then here in the app store, we can just search bold. We can search bold membership. Okay, and then I'll just install the first one here. And click install. Okay, and then we're gonna install that over here. And then you just need to approve the billing. So there's a 14 day free trial. So just click approve. Okay, great. So now we need to just accept the terms, the terms and conditions and then install this app into our theme so click accept and continue okay and then you can either have them install it for you or you can install it yourself manually so i'll go with option two okay and then we're using the, the dawn theme so we can say it looks good okay so i'll just show you how to do it yourself as this is an, an automated method so let's just go back okay and then we're going to install this ourselves so go into liquid installations again and then go to their instructions so over here in the manual instructions we need to just add these files okay so we'll just copy these and paste it into our theme so go over here into online store and then themes and what you want to do is here and go to edit code Okay, and then down here, right in the snippets, we're gonna add new snippets. And then we're gonna go back to the installation guide and copy the file name. So you just need to install, include the name of the file prior to liquid. Okay. Okay, so it's already here, so let's just check. Okay, great. So it seems like it was copied over once you installed the app. So that's good. But again, if you just need to do it manually, just double check these files here and you can do that through the installation guide. Okay, so back here in the membership app, what you want to do is create a new plan. Okay, so back here in the membership app, it's saying that we need to connect our Stripe account. So do that first. Okay, so you just need to connect your Stripe account here. Okay, great. So I connected my Stripe account over here. And then you can look over the other settings here. So make sure the email is correct here. So this is just a test shop. So I, I'm not using a verified domain. And then you can update the language structure over here. Okay, great. So I think the general settings have been set up correctly. So now let's go back to the dashboard and create a plan. So what you want to do is go here and create a new membership plan. Okay, so let's say this is for Shopify support. Support plan, get 30-day unlimited Shopify help. Okay, and then you can enable a free trial or email verification. So that's Email verification is good so that it prevents spam. Okay, and then we'll just do a monthly cycle of 199. And then this is recurring, but if you wanna do like an installment plan, then you can do say after 12 payments, then that customer will be paid off. But this one is recurring, so I'll keep it as forever. And if you wanna do weekly or quarterly or yearly billing, you can do that over here as well. So let's say yearly billing, 999. Okay, and then say registration field. So let's say your Shopify URL. It's required. And then you can add rules. So we can show certain products certain collections here so we can show like a product where they can place an order for a shopify fix 
Okay, so I'll create that product first. So let's just go back into products here. And then add product. Play Shopify Health. Get help on our Shopify test. Okay, and it's not a physical product. Okay, so we'll save that. Okay, so this product will only be shown if you're if you have a support subscription. Okay, so let's just save this. Okay, and then we'll create the widget after. Okay, so let's just go back to our plan here and go to edit. And then select the product for this one over here. Okay, so this product will show only for subscribed users. Okay, and then now we need to get the widget here. So this is to sign up. So we can copy this and then go here into our pages and then create Shopify support sign up. Okay, and then go here into the custom code and then paste that and save. And then let's view it in the store. Awesome, so over here you're able to set up an account. So we see over here, it even has this custom field that we set up. So you can do monthly or yearly over here. And then it gives you like the description, it gives you the description and the title. Okay, so I'm just gonna add the support page in the main menu here. So go to navigation, main menu, and here into pages and Shopify support. And then save menu. Okay, and then now I have Shopify support here and the form shows up. Okay, great, so now we have our membership set up. So now let's just go over the other features of the membership app. So over here, you can see any transactions that were made within your memberships. And then here you can see your existing user base and here is the settings, which we went over. And then lastly, over here, they have the styling, which you can go into and change the font sizing and the coloring. So you can do that through this module here. Okay, so over here in the plans module, you can just invite users directly. So you can just invite them directly through email. And then over here, if we edit the widget over here, if we edit the plan over here, we can go down to more rules and then we can hide certain pages as well and products and collections for subscribe users. So you can have two catalogs. So one for subscribe users and then one for unsubscribed users. So this concludes the end of the video. I hope you're able to follow along in adding Bold Membership app to our Shopify store. Please like and subscribe for more content like this and I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks.